So, what's your research about, Cosmin? My research is about uh, bicycles and bicycle systems in the sense that I'm trying to think how to imagine a bicycle system where, where you would be able to replace the automobile disease system which is currently dominating our societies. And I'm using a lot of utopias and degrowth paradigms in order to make this thinking possible. Great. And what's mobile about it more specifically? Well, the bicycle is mobile <laughs> and in order to uh, really understand what velo mobilities are, you should get from behind the uh, screen of the, of the car and actually ride a bicycle in order to understand the affordances that a bicycle um, allows. And I have a specific chapter on how senses are different for cyclists, for example. Then there are the methods, basically, which are highly mobile. I'm using a lot of um, audio recordings on the go, a lot of ride-alongs, a lot of uh, video footage as well. So the methods are very, very mobile as well. Then uh, the type of perspective I, I uh, engage uh, with my research, which is kind of having these mobilities in both time and space, meaning that for a discussion of infrastructure, for example, you have to understand how, for example, the roads in the past have been used by cyclists and how they contribute to the paving of roads that cars get used and eventually how they have been put to the margins of the roads and how they are now claiming again their space on the roads. And also geographically because constantly you have to make reference to places where cycling is really a culture in a sense. You would have to think about Netherlands and Denmark and go and see how uh, these places perform in terms of cycling and why this is happening and what is to be learned from, from their experience. So is it just the uh, mobilities of people and uh, goods that you're interested in? Well, it's in the first uh, thinking about mobilities of people and then of course it's mobilities of goods because in order to get rid of car system, you have to think, well, how are you going to transport um, things around? So it's quite critical to understand how types of bikes, such as cargo bikes, can be made, made available again and can be used on a large scale, and how to do these transportations uh, of, of bigger goods, for example. It's also uh, mobilizing ideas about uh, how to achieve, as I was saying, kind of a more equalitarian societies with the bicycle and how to achieve these visions of the growth that I'm talking about. So it's about mobilizing these kind of values around the bicycle, which are not just about transporting and feeding the bicycle into a neoliberal paradigm. You have to think about the bicycles as a potential for social change as well. Great, thank you. Thank you.